So there is an article in the Washington Post, which I will be very honest with all of my subscribers, I would never know about. But over the weekend, I had the in-laws over who read the Washington Post faithfully. And my father-in-law was telling me about this article about uh, the solar storm in 2012 that uh, was a near miss and how us preppers really missed out. <laughs> I guess in his mind, he thinks we uh, all preppers want SHTF uh, to happen. And I tried to explain to him that uh, that is not the case. And uh, I hope that for all of our sake, uh, it never happens, at least in my lifetime. But at any rate, that's a different conversation. I just thought I would share this link uh, in this article with my subscribers. And, uh, I, you know, I remember the hoopla about this solar storm. And they kind of compared it to the uh, Carrington event in uh, the 1850s. And uh, with the rotation of the Earth, had this solar flare happened one week earlier, uh, it would have been catastrophic. Um, but because uh, at the time when it did happen, it wasn't an Earth-facing uh, solar flare. And... Um, they were also talking about how four days before a CME kind of went through and kind of cleared the path, which would have made the solar flare that much more significant and a direct hit. Um, so I'll leave the link and uh, you guys can read it and uh, woulda, coulda, shoulda. But uh, I, I just thought it was interesting that one, it was in the post. Um, and, uh, you know, it is what it is. Uh, I, again, I, I never read this newspaper or hardly any newspaper for that matter. Not when there's so much great uh, information on YouTube, right? <laughs> Who needs a newspaper? Uh, but anyway, uh, the link will be down in the description box, guys. There's a couple videos you can click on. And uh, if anything, um, check your preps, man. Uh, this is really, you know... These solar flares and CMEs and stuff, they just scare the shit out of me because it is just something that I hope I never have to see in my lifetime because really the years that it would take to rebuild from this is just, I don't know if any of us have that kind of preps, uh, you know, to last that long. Um, of course, we would be better than the average uh, Joe out there, but, uh, you know, the years for the infrastructure to be rebuilt just scary. Anyway, read it. Have fun. As always, if you're not in preparedness, you're preparing to fail. Can you say bye-bye?